Hi, this is Dan, and I am here with more Let's Play of Monster Train with the Last Divinity DLC. So we are going to start up another run here, and I think we've cycled around to Hellhorned, um, no, <laughs> Wormkin with Hellhorned allies. So let's use the, the, this guy, Wormkin, and... Yeah, default, I think, but I think we do want to try for some, um, well, we'll see what champion we get. Alright, so this is interesting. We've got some area effect damage. Okay, rage doesn't decay. I think that's really solid. Cheaper units, also pretty solid. This is interesting, right? We just got some expensive spells. We got this one that's expensive. These guys are expensive. So let's try that. And we know there's uh, some expensive rage spells in the deck, or in the potential deck. All right, so I think you're good. And my hope is eventually we'll get some imps. Like if we could get some armor imps, that would be ideal. Um, no, not give them armor. <laughs> give me armor. <laughs> or rage imps would also be good, actually. Oh, we have that thing. Uh, okay, so, you go here, zero damage. I mean, there's not a whole lot we can do here. Like, I think we just hope that... Um, we can... Uh, beat the boss. And this guy's just going to do a little bit of damage to the pyre. good and that's ought to kill him nope gets real close yeah uh, we need something to give us some uh, some offensive firepower here 
because the spells are just not cutting it. Kind of sucked. Hopefully we get something good here. Another one of these. I think... Yeah, let's get this. Alright, well, this is good. It's expensive. It gives us rage. That doesn't decay. So you have a rage thing. So I think I like you. Even though the slide trigger is kind of hard to make work. Uh, let's go over this way. Hmm. See, so we both have interesting stuff going on. This is probably better, but you don't fit. You'd have to be on your own floor, um, but you don't synergize with the rage guy. So let's get you and then we'll see what we can do in here. So we can make something large. I mean, if you have to be on your own floor anyway, Being large is probably okay. And obviously we want to get a multi-strike on him. Now if we do this, we the only way we can get multi-strike is... Well... No, it's alright. Here on each floor. We have a lot of direct damage, so I think we can do this, although it's dangerous. If the game becomes responsive. Oh crap, haster. That's bad. Um, Take a little more pyre damage. the uh, ember drain got us um, I guess we'll do that
Yeah, you know what? I should have realized he, if we could keep these guys alive, he was dead already. We should have killed the guy in the, uh, this guy. Uh, all right, I really misplayed this fight. I think it was. Um, I shouldn't have taken that. I got greedy. Oh, we're winning. That's a bit of a surprise. And yeah, we're even surviving. Alright. I guess he does very little damage, so I guess that does make sense. I think I like more armor. Alright, Rage Imp. It's really good. I mean, this is pretty good too. It's infused, but we've got some of these already, and Rage doesn't decay. Okay, let's go over here. And a random imp. I think that's pretty solid. Um, okay. Neither of these are that fantastic. I mean, the the etch is all right. Uh, I don't think we have enough consume to really make it work. Um, and you're pretty expensive. We have already got an expensive dude. Um, So, so let's skip these. Hmm, five copies. Anything we care about getting that many copies of. I guess Ritual of Battle? It's a little weird. Um, alternatively, this. But I think uh, Ritual of Battle, it's expensive. It's, that sort of synergizes with our anvil. Um, gives us a lot of rage. I think it's a little weird. Um, I think it kind of works. And then now the question is, now where's our other? Do we want to combine you into the Alpha Fiend? Um, I 
or hold off on that. And right for right now, you can work with the Spine Chief, and the Alpha Fiend can be on his own with the uh, the Rage Imp. And that lets us hold off a turn. Magic power and piercing. Maybe we could do that with this. Alternatively, maybe this. All right, because then we can also play this for free if we want. It does a minimum of 10. Okay. Um. I forgot we have the free imps as well. Okay. Well, um, You know what? And you can hang out with a train steward. There we go. Okay. I think we need to get you up here. Extract anything. That's not what I'm trying to I'm trying to cast you. All right. Elder Helper is finally something we want. You're dying unless I do something about that. Okay, so you're okay. I wanted to give the Welder Helper to you. Hmm. 
but if we do this, you actually survive. I'm just trying to get an echo here for this guy's superpower to uh, be useful. really nothing I can do about that uh, You're getting killed. Alright. So let us. Do this, I guess. that Speed this up, I guess. Some extra rage is going to be good. Come on, just get over there. All right. <laughs> So, 
Seven pyre health is not great, but we, we got the victory. So there is that. Um, so we don't have a lot of imps in the deck. I think let's take this. This is interesting in that it gives you seven range, but I think this will be good for our champion. Well, we can get another one of the. I don't think we've upgraded our existing banded warrior. So we could take this guy, sacrifice the other one into this. The alternative is. Um, we take you and we uh, add you to the uh, to the existing alpha fiend and make him just a highly alpha fiend. I think I like that. And then we need ember because we are getting super constrained with trying to play our cost three spells everywhere. Um, we do need Pyre Health. We also need unit upgrades. Um, hmm. Do we need. I don't think we need spell upgrades, honestly, so let's go over here. Um. This is interesting. This is also interesting. So we have this, which extracts, and we like playing it. And these guys give us armor. And this is also really nice. Um, I'm going to take this because I think it's our biggest weakness is being able to um, survive. Uh, Alright, well, armor 30 I don't think does a whole lot for us. Multi strike, please. I mean, we know multi-strike is the, uh, okay, another large stone, which doesn't really help us. Um, this, I mean, we could try to make you large. And unfortunately, he has to be on a floor by himself. are not multi-strike so that kind of sucked <laughs> not sure why these loading screens are taking longer than usual today <laughs> I 
again, I'm not sure why this loading screen is taking a while. Um, yeah, I'm feeling like we, we're just kind of um, getting stuff in the wrong order. Like we really need a combiner to combine our um, alpha fiend and we really need a multi-strike. Uh, and we're not getting the things we need in order to get to the next level and our deck is kind of, I don't, know, I don't think it really works just yet um, an artifact to be really good I don't think we have the um, the ability to uh, um, absorb that much damage so we could put you know, let's uh, let's put you down here. Which means I guess puts you up here. There's no charged echoes anywhere, so there's no point in playing that. Alright, well. At least you're going to get a kill. Send him gives us Ember. All right, so you're dead. That's fine. echo up here because then the champion will be better for next turn <laughs> okay, these pirate chompers are not terrible. Hmm. 
Yeah. All right. So hopefully this guy is uh, good enough to win here. So we're almost certainly going to win on a, the next floor or two. This is interesting with an infuse on it. Yeah. Do we have any consume cards? Jeez. Hey, our armor cards, I guess, are consumes. We're still looking for a multi strike. So let's go over here. We can also get some pyre health. Hmm. Large, I don't think we can do. Rage! I mean, getting a little extra rage on you is not terrible. Strike Alpha Fiend. And we sacrifice the non upgraded Alpha Fiend to help you out. Now, the problem is. Um, you're too big to work with imps, which is not ideal. Okay, so next upgrade we might want to go capacity. Um, I don't think these spell upgrades are what we need. Okay, so you're the stealth boss. Sycophants. Harvester appear on each floor. Um, I think we can do that. Even if they get past us on the top floor, there the first round isn't too terrible. Okay, so. You go there. Hmm. Yeah. 
Um, oh, we get six because of the armor hammer. Okay. To clear these guys out, which we can do with a level two, actually no, with a, even a free event, we'll do that. Um, or this. Okay. Um. So that's fine. Um, nothing to extract anywhere else, so I guess we'll do that. Survive. You're dying, unfortunately. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you're, he's suffering from being too big for the train. <laughs> we can't uh, can't give him any help from the imps. Um, we need some kind of heal or something for him. And did we not have four ember? Like, why are we... Why do we never have enough? I guess maybe the uh, the imp that I put up there. That makes sense. dying unless we can come up with a way to do something to you Yeah. 
Alright. This is not necessarily the worst thing, so we can bring armor back, which is good. So I guess we can do that. Uh Great if I could get the welder helper up here. I can't. So played that a little bit. I forgot that we needed to kill this guy so the guy in the back can... Yeah, we're so constrained. It's aggravating. It feels like nothing actually works. Yeah, we're dead. Yeah, I mean... I... I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. It's like, yeah, obviously my guys are too weak, but I can't do anything if it never gives me any armor, you know? It's like, I've got two cards in the deck that are armor, and I can't I can't make a super thin deck around those two cards, you know? It's like, I need the other things too. And you've got to get the monsters so you have the material to, you know, to upgrade with. I don't know. All right, well... Hope you enjoyed watching, and I hope you come back next time. Bye.